up guys? This is FennyChase Z and today I'm gonna show you how to customize your Unity launcher following just uh, an easy steps. You know? The only thing you got to know is that Unity launcher by default is not uh, customizable at all, okay? The only thing you can customize here is this one, okay? I'm gonna show you now. Uh, for example, here in appearance, we got just this option. The size of launcher icons, I got it 48. I see it a little bit, so I can reduce this value, for example, in. Here, okay, 22 for example. Now we see the icons are so so small, as you can see here, and it's so difficult to click on it. But we can also set our default configuration. Yes, slicing this this button here. And now it's 48 and it's as before. Okay, now here in behavior we have these another options. Uh, for example, sensibility of launcher. I got it back setting on default. But if you see that it's so hard to to deploy launcher here when you when you press the, the corner you can't uh, increase this value into high settings or lower but here you got this option now here in this option I have uh, configured this option for hiding automatically the launcher because I don't like having the launcher Every time I I I work with my PC, I got the launcher here. I got a physical launcher here, and, and I don't personally like it. So the the only thing I, I I did here is to click on this option, and the launcher automatically automatically hide here in this corner. Okay. We can choose the position of the launcher. I had it in the in the in the left side side. But also I can I can set that I can press on the on the on the top on the top corner of my screen on the top left corner of my screen. And, and it will appear, uh, and it will appear, okay? But but instead of that, I have it like this. We can choose this to test it. It doesn't work here, but if I press in the corner, it will appear. Oh well, wait for it. No, it does. Oh well, here, you see this? Oh. Well. Well, as you can see here, it doesn't work so well because of my screen recorder that is hiding this, this part of the screen uh, uh, it's not letting me to show or to reveal the launcher but if I press on the default option that was in the left side, side I can now reveal it with an easy caution on the side of the screen also, I got more options like add an icon to to reveal desktop in the launcher, but I don't like it. I personally don't like it. It's like this one. Okay, I can click on it, and now my you know my main screen that I was working on 
disappear and now if I click on the button on this button again and it will appear it's fast but it has default settings for example to reveal for example and it has default settings if I click here in my in this button it will you know close for a for a moment but it will take a few a few times that is by default in the, in the system configuration and I can't configure it you can also activate work areas this is very useful for example if I if I work with multitasking or you know if I have some uh, different things at the same time of my computer and I want to to manage it with a with a more you know uh, order way or you know we can click on it and this icon button appear here now we got this key combination control L and uh, and the uh, directions buttons it's really simple I don't I don't I don't personally like it but, so I I click and I could activate it um, and nothing as far as that as uh, you see there is no more there's some buttons here so I feel that unity could be more customizable but there are no by default in the system so what I recommend you guys is to firstly install this and actually for 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 do uh, this step to follow this step easily uh, like this way control alt to open a terminal the faster and we use sudo su to rewrite now our password and now we can install the sign up to packet uh, this way app get install sign up to. I already have it so it says okay now once we have this sign up to packet installed on our system we can click on it, it will ask for our password, we enter it, okay, and now here in this interface, here in the fast filter, we can find for Ubuntu, quick, true, okay, Ubuntu trick. Oh, there's nothing here. Ubuntu. Ah, oh well, it's not Ubuntu, it's Unity tool. Tool, a uh, trick tool. Unity trick. Okay, here it is. We mark it for install. Apply settings. It will take just a few seconds to download and install. Okay, we wait for it. We wait. Now we close it. Once it's installed on the power system. Okay, now we have it here. In our launcher, Unity launcher, we have we have to right here, Unity trick tell. Here it is. As you can see, the system. Okay, here we have this. Here we have we have everything that have any relation with Unity, okay? Here we have the launcher, we have the founder, we have the panel selector, application uh, additional that I I really don't don't know what it is. That but we are gonna test it later. Okay, first launcher. Okay, launcher. As you can see we have more and more options than before. And also this option were the, la the, the ones that we got before we for example have hiding automatically 
we have activated animation to auto hiding I have the, I had the one by the by default reveal in the left side or in the corner left side um, sensibility appearance well this one is so so good function because it let us to to see um, under the panel you know transparency legal transparent of our unit launcher also we have the we have we can choose the color we have this option by the pool setting us the color that our our background wallpaper has but, yeah but we can also customize it okay, icons animation uh, animation of urgency for example when when a when a program has to to do something quickly and uh, and want to I don't know I uh, I want our attention it has a, a pretty cool animation also for when we open or we click on an animation or on an icon it has a, a default animation for example tools are here we also have uh, wallpapers and icons yeah, we can choose one and also the side of icons as I show you guys before okay the founder the founder is here this is Fluger, is when you click here, you see that the, the background is like blur and you can see you can see um, you can choose the label of this blur in this option. If I click on it, the background appears like like man without blurring. No? But I prefer this one. Uh, found for phones in, uh, online. Uh, show suggestions. Show recently used it, and also activate finding files. We can place the historic. Well, I don't know how the the word is in English, but you know the. The historical or, or something like that the panel okay you see that that we can choose for how long the menu is visible on our system we come we have chosen on two seconds and also enable the level of transparency uh, indicators times um, and date uh, calendar, Bluetooth. I don't have Bluetooth, so I I choose it for for I don't know. Dis disabled. Uh, energy. I have a, a, a laptop, so I I let it I let it here turn on. And the uh, volume, notifications. Uh, you know. Um. You know, layouts here, uh, web applications. I don't, I, I don't want Amazon, for example. I, I don't want Ubuntu one. So I don't know. I, I, I turn off these options. And additional, uh, for example, if I, if I press on a button, or if I, if I write to find something, some program in on this launcher here you see that unity that we found that we that we found before is still there so if we don't want this we can click on this option to disactivate and now oh which is more 
Well, it's something like that. Uh, okay, nothing as for that.